the Switch is doing fantastic with the sales, the games, and just the all-around design of the system, it's pretty safe to say that this one is one of the greatest consoles of all time. But without good games, a console is nothing. Luckily, the Switch provides. The amount of quality games that are on this system is amazing. Breath of the Wild, Mario Odyssey, Splatoon 2, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, Kirby Star Allies, just to name a few, and even more to come! The fact that Super Smash Bros. is coming on this thing is worth the buy, so if you haven't done that, get on it. But there's a few games that I would love to see on the Switch. The potential and possibilities are endless with this thing. The fact that it's portable makes it a go-to system when porting games or indie devs to promote their games. So, you've read the title, you know what's happening, here are some games that I personally want on the Switch. Just a quick note before we get started, I am aware that some of these games will likely never be on the Switch, it's just my personal wants for this system. These games aren't ranked in any order, I would love to see all of them on this list. So without further ado, let's do it. I never got to try a hat in time. It looked really appealing, but Super Mario Odyssey's hype was too much for me. It's been almost a year since the release of this game, and judging by the reviews and how much people loved this game, why not put it on the Switch? The game would look and probably run really well on the Switch. It looks like a game made for the system. The graphics are bright, colorful, and cartoony, and it just doesn't seem right it's not on the Switch. This game looks so fun, and I don't think another 3D platformer would hurt the Switch, <laughs> right? I can say that a hat in time would fit perfectly on the Switch just by looking at it. The gameplay, the polish, and the art style makes this game a must-have on the system. Okay, this is just one that I would personally love, but never get. Rare Replay is a compilation of most of the games Rareware has created. Seeing Banjo-Kazooie on a Nintendo system again would bring tears to my eyes. It's just sad that Microsoft had to ruin this chemistry Rare and Nintendo had. Microsoft isn't even using Rare to their full potential. Sea of Thieves was a bust, Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts is terrible, and even Rare Replay was just a cheap cash grab. I guess that's why we have Playtonic, I mean, at least they're trying. I'm like... <clears throat> someone. It would be amazing if Nintendo and Microsoft could work something out and bring this amazing compilation to the Switch's shelves. With Metroid Prime 4 coming to the Switch, who knows when, it would be much appreciated if you brought the whole Prime trilogy with it. I know people are probably sick of ports by now, but I never got a chance to play this series of Metroid games, and having these games to play before Metroid Prime 4 comes out would, would be smart. And it doesn't even need to be a remaster with the graphical upgrade or anything, I just want to experience these games before Prime 4 comes out. My Wii and Wii U are trash, so please Nintendo, make this happen. Mike Tyson's Punch-Out is one of my favorite games on the NES. Its unique take on the fighting genre makes a classic and fun series, but we haven't seen a new entry in the series since 2009. The revived game on the Wii sold over a million copies, and it makes sense for them to make a sequel on the Switch. ARMS showed off the capabilities of the Joy-Cons and motion controls in a fighting setting, so why not implement that into a new Punch-Out game? They could do the same thing as the Wii game did, remake or rework old familiar characters while also adding a handful of newcomers. I would like to see how the HD rumble could be implemented in your punches or blocking attacks. This series needs another entry, and what better system to revive the series once again than the Switch. Now you could say that one Mario Kart is enough, but no. No, we need an official Mario Kart 9. Now, I could care less about the anti-gravity gimmick. I would love to see something new and fresh. Maybe some sort of hovercraft mechanic like in Diddy Kong Racing. And let's go even further on that path and add a single player story mode. Honestly though, I would love this so much. Nintendo always comes up with something, so I'm not worried about that. The thing I am worried about is this whole Nintendo Kart thing. Please, just, just keep Mario Kart. I also made a video on this topic. Uh, just just a warning. This was my first video, so yeah. Yeah, cringe. Cringe warning. So yeah, Mario Kart Switch. Keep it Mario Kart, please. 
I'm begging you. Remember the rumor of The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening being remade for the 3DS? Well, I want that to happen for the Switch. Having a top-down Zelda on the Switch in HD would be incredible, especially if it's Link's Awakening, the most underrated Zelda game ever. By the way, also made a video on that. Click somewhere around around here. Just, just do it. Seriously though, Nintendo needs to give some love to this game. I mean, they remade Metroid 2 from the Game Boy, and I think they can do Link's Awakening. The 3DS library of games is slowing down, so I doubt there'll be any chances of remaking this game for that. So let's do it for the Switch in a bigger and better way. Let us awaken this game from its obscure sleep and show everyone what they've missed out all these years. It's been six years since the last 2D Mario game, and I think that's given them enough time to think of something new. <laughs> So, so funny. For real though, Super Mario Odyssey showed Nintendo is not out of ideas. And I feel like they have some ideas for the next 2D Mario game. I mean, like I said, they've had six years to think about it. So hopefully they figure something out. This game needs to be set in a whole different world, like Super Mario World or Odyssey or even Sunshine. Enough of this Mushroom Kingdom jazz. Let's get something weird, something out of the box. Hopefully Nintendo is already in the works for this. So Nintendo, don't screw this one up. Okay, Nintendo, I don't like how you're treating your best freaking franchise that you have. Well, next to Smash. But it's time to get serious. We need a legit... Let me say that again. We need a legit Paper Mario game. None of this garbage. We need the RPG mechanics, the partners, the badges, the battle system. We need the real Paper Mario to come back. It could set an all new world with new creatures, enemies, bosses, you name it. Miyamoto, this is the only thing I'm mad at you about. Everything else I, I love about you. But let's bring back the originality of Paper Mario. Whatever happened to that 3DS one that looked Phenomenal! I know there's going to be a Paper Mario on the system, but I really hope they do it right. It seems like Nintendo is trying to fix their franchises, so I have faith that Nintendo will do something about this. But seriously, Nintendo, please stop messing with my favorite franchise you've created. Bring back the OG Paper Mario, okay? Love you. I honestly don't care what they do, I just want another entry in the Earthbound series. And I know what you're thinking, oh Nintendo is not going to make another one of these, they still haven't even re-released Mother 3, but honestly, it's a legit possibility. Nintendo is trying their hardest to make this the best console they've ever made, even going on to say they want everyone in the world to have a Switch, and that includes Earthbound fans. Adding a new entry in the series could just push the Switch over the edge to become the greatest Nintendo console ever made. If they could make a game from every franchise they've created, the Switch's library would be a masterpiece. Now if this does happen, I'm guessing it won't be for a while. It may take time, but I'm hoping that Nintendo understands the potential this game would have and the impact it would have on the Switch's life. In the same way Super Mario Galaxy had two games on the Wii, I want that to happen to Odyssey. And I get why they had a sequel to Galaxy on the same console, they just had so many ideas that could fit into a whole new game, but I believe that Nintendo could pull this one off. Odyssey is the best selling game on the Switch so far, and looking at how well that game did, it's really a no brainer to make a sequel. If not on the Switch, then I would guarantee it would be on the next console they make. I loved Odyssey so much, it was an amazing throwback to Super Mario 64. So I thought maybe the sequel could be a throwback to Sunshine, maybe adding a similar mechanic to Flood or the art style could be more of a tropical feeling. All I really want is just more Odyssey. So please Nintendo, I, I would love you more more than I do now. I would love to see all these games on the system, and I know some of them are long shots, but a guy can dream. I do expect to see a couple of these games on the Switch sooner or later, but in the meantime, we have Super Smash Bros. Ultimate to look forward to. 
I could really care less about any other game right now, except Paper Mario. I need it now. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit that like button down below. Follow me on Twitter, and if you're new, why not subscribe? See you guys later. Bye-bye.